Today we celebrate St. Nicholas of Lou. From his youth in Switzerland, Nicholas was a member of a Catholic lay association called the Friends of God. Scattered throughout Switzerland, the Netherlands, and Germany, members saw closeness to Christ through a disciplined life and meditation. Though totally dedicated to peace, patriotism led Nicholas to fight in wars to defend Switzerland. At the age of 30, he married Dorothy and they had 10 children. 20 years later, at the age of 50, Nicholas sensed God's call to live a contemplative life as a hermit. Dorothy, also a member of the Friends of God, believed that Nicholas had a divine commission. Nicholas spent the next 20 years in a remote cottage. He prayed most of the night, but in afternoons he welcomed visitors. During these years he took no food or drink, only Holy Communion. In 1481, Nicholas played a major role in solidifying the unity of Switzerland. After the cantons secured independence by defeating the German king, a dispute threatened to divide the cantons. They consulted Nicholas, and within an hour after obtaining his advice, they agreed to include the territories. The people of Switzerland call him Brother Claus. On December 21, 1487, Nicholas died after an illness of eight days. <laughs>